What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to boost your FPS and overall performance when playing Rocket League on a low-end PC or laptop. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions, then leave a comment and let me know. First, open up the game and navigate to your video settings. The changes you make here can already have a big impact on your system's performance. Set the display resolution to your native monitor resolution. Set the display mode to full screen. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. Disable VSync as well as anti-aliasing. Set the render quality option to performance as well as the render detail option. Also, make sure to cap your frame rate to a value above your screen's refresh rate but below the maximum FPS you can get. This will help save some valuable resources while in-game. In the advanced video settings, Simply set your texture detail, world detail and particle detail options to performance. All of the settings below should be disabled for best performance. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Right click your taskbar to open up your task manager. Here in the processes tab, right click Rocket League and select to go to details. In the details tab, the rocketleague.exe application should be highlighted. Simply right-click it and set the priority to high. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should increase your performance, especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other programs, I suggest you to end some programs from running in the background which you don't need while playing the game. But make sure to only add programs from running which you know won't break your operating system. In the Startup tab, you can additionally prevent programs from starting up on System Boot. You can now close the game and exit out of your Task Manager. When this is done, search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar System Settings window. Here, uncheck the Recording option. And in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the Background Recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, make sure that your graphics driver is up to date. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application if you're using an NVIDIA GPU. But you can also use the AMD driver suit. Depending on how frequently you're updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. When this is done, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates System Settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. Next, right-click your desktop and select NVIDIA Control Panel. You can do the same step with the AMD driver suit. Here, navigate to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add Rocket League from the program list. Below, we will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. When this is done, search for Graphic Settings and open up your Graphic System Settings. On this window, select Browse and your File Explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on. Program Files, Rocket League, Binaries, Win64 and here make sure to select the Rocket League application and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that your graphics preference is set to high performance. Don't forget to apply your changes. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.